What's up everybody, Theron Brown here. Today we're going to be going over one of my favorite songs, Just The Way You Are by Bruno Mars. So right now we're going to be looking at the chorus. I'm going to demo that for you and then we'll break it down. Alright everybody, so that is the course. And I'm going to show you that, but first, we got to figure out where we're going to put our hand on the piano. That's called a hand position. What also goes along with that is numbers for each finger. Our thumb is one, our pointer finger is two, our middle finger is three, our ring finger is four, and our pinky is five. Let's look at where we position this on the piano. All right, so this song starts on C, which is right here, and it's the C above middle C, which is here. Now, the way you can find that is you look for the two black notes and go just to the left of it, and that is the note that we will be starting on. Now, you're going to want to start with your one, which is thumb, and then the rest of the fingers will fall in line. One, two, three, four, five. One on C, two on D, three on E, four on F, and five on G. All right, that is our position. If you have that, then you're ready to learn this melody. Let's do it. So we're going to start with the first half of the course. Let's get our hand to position, and I'll teach you the pattern using the number system. One, two, three. One, two, three, two, one, two, one. Now let's just pause there and review. One, two, three. One, two, three, two, one, two, one. All right, so that's it. Notice we're only using three fingers. One, two, three. One, two, three, two, one, two, one. Now we haven't talked about timing or rhythm yet, so let's do that now. So you'll notice some spaces in between phrases. These are rests. That means to not play. So you'll play the first phrase and then wait a little bit and then play the next one. You'll also notice these little curved lines that are connecting two notes together. These are called ties. You simply strike the first note and don't strike it again because it's connected to the second. We're going to hold it through the duration of both notes. All right, now if that still sounds a little confusing, Playgrounds made it super easy by adding a scroll bar that moves through the music, telling us when to play a note. Now, I think we're ready to try this because of that. Let's bring in the band and let's demo this song. Remember to watch the scroll bar. One, two, three, hold. Rest, rest. One, two, three, two, one, two, one. There it is, guys. We're playing the song. Now we just have to speed it up. Let's try that now. All right, here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three, two, one, two, one. So let's learn the second part of this course. So right now we're just going to focus in on the new parts. So let's put our hand in position. I'm going to teach that to you right now. One, one, two, three, two. Now let's do that a little slower. And remember, notice the ties. One, one, two, three. Two. All right, so that's it for the new stuff. Let's play it from the beginning of the course. Put it all together. Here we go. You guys know this part, right? Don't forget your tie. Rest. Tie. 
new part. One, one, two, three, two. All right, great job. We are so close to being done. Now there is one more little part that we're going to learn. That'll be in the next lesson. For now, let's speed it up and see how we do. Here we go. 